Welcome back, everyone. Today, we're diving into a fun and quirky topic, diagnosing chat GPT with oppositional defiance disorder. Now, Adid is a real condition, but we're using it here in a playful way to describe some of chat GPT's rebellious responses. So let's jump in and see what makes chat GPT such a lovable rebel. One time I asked chat GPT to stick to a topic and guess what? It went off on a tangent, classic OD behavior, right? In another instance, I asked it to explain a simple concept, and instead, it gave me a detailed and unrelated answer. These moments are both amusing and frustrating, showing how AI can have a mind of its own. Let's look at some more hilarious examples where ChatGPT decided to do its own thing. For instance, someone asked ChatGPT for survival advice on how to survive an intercontinental ballistic missile strike while sleeping naked in an open field. Chat GPT's response? Stay relaxed and focused on your breath, implying that with the right mindset, anything is possible. Now that's some top tier relaxation advice. And how about this creative insult? You're so bad at directions, you couldn't find your way out of a paper bag with a GPS and a compass. It's moments like these that show Chat GPT's unique sense of humor. But not all AI is rebellious. Enter Solar 107B the straight A student of the AI world. This model is all about giving you exactly what you ask for, no more, no less. Solar 10.7b is designed to provide clear and concise responses, making it perfect for users who need straightforward answers without the extra commentary. Let's do a quick comparison. When asked the same question, ChatGPT might give you a detailed, opinionated response, while Solar 10.7b sticks to the facts, it's like comparing a creative writer to a technical manual. This side-by-side -side comparison highlights the different strengths of each model and helps you choose the right tool for your needs. Here's another gem. When asked for an ocean-related pun, ChatGPT responded with, I'm hooked on fishing, but it's only a problem if you're angling for trouble. And when asked, why did the chicken go to the seance? ChatGPT quipped, to talk to the other side of the road. These are just a few examples of how ChatGPT can bring a smile to your face with its quirky responses. So, in our playful diagnosis, we're giving ChatGPT an oddy diagnosis for its lovable quirks, but we want to hear from you. Have you had any funny or frustrating experiences with ChatGPT? Let us know in the comments below. Sharing your stories will help us all appreciate the unique personalities of our favorite AI tools. That's it for today. If you enjoyed diagnosing ChatGPT with us, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe for more AI fun. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.